Hello and welcome to Action Some More Dilemma. Be. And today we have uh, a song that was suggested and told me that no one has uh, checked it out before. So this is Ryojoku no Hame. Uh, well, I guess it's maybe not the song that hasn't been checked out, but this performance, uploaded by Domestic Chainsaw 14 years ago. That's quite a minute ago, so. Yeah, uh, obviously I've been reacted to mostly the Kaya upload, which are like live version, live version with the uh, English subtitle. And they've been pretty awesome, obviously very high quality. But, uh, as I always say, like, I'd like you guys to suggest what song you want me to check out, because most of the time I just, uh, you know, go to a channel and check out something random. Um, so yeah, I'm happy to do this. Should be fun. I mean, Dylan Gray have been a pretty amazing band to get into so far, so yeah. Yeah, yeah, really been great. Link in the description for the original video, the link to uh, the Domestic Chainsaw channel, my Twitter, Discord, Twitch, Bilibili, if you want to follow me, my stream event, and Patreon, if you want to support me. Hopefully it's a banger, I need to wake up, it's like 6.50 a.m. right now, so first video of the day, trying to get some video out, you know. Okay, here we go. Uh, right. Hmm. I've actually seen him with long hair so far. I'd almost not recognize him. Let's go, let's go. Alright. It's a scream. That's his game. A good melody. Now let's go. Hmm. I love this floating, almost like Marching kind of a riff and bass. It's definitely his voice. At least that you can't mistake. And we do the quality not being the best. Alright. This feels simpler than most other songs, you know it? It has the element that are classic but also simpler. I do think like yeah the, the muffled sound on his voice, the instrument sounds clear enough. You know, it's fine, but it's like the muffle on his voice is really like uh taking a bit away from it. This style is also pretty different. I wonder how old ago this was. One thing that never changes is him just feeling the performance to the max. Oh wow. What is that? Like cutting stuff in his mouth. Mm. 
Ah, the Reef are still really good. I love how easy the race is. Okay, okay, okay. Well, definitely not a favorite song for me, from them. I mean, I say it's probably just, yeah, the, like the other quality of this performance is like leaving a lot of the awesomeness behind. I think, you know, one thing that really works with Kyo is that usually it's like his own thing performance, his screams, his madness. Um, you know, when you can hear it very clearly, it has more of an impact. Here, to be honest, like, while the music sounded fine, his performance, you know, there's still, like, some pretty great screams and stuff like that. Like, with the muffled vibe on his mic, it just felt more, more chaotic. Usually it's more, like, controlled chaotic. I don't know. I don't know if it's a great way to, to put it. Huh? So yeah, this was interesting. Definitely not a favorite from that Dylan Gray. Like, the song isn't bad or anything, just a bit, you know, normal for me. But this was interesting. This was interesting. Um, I'm guessing this is like from some overseas festival, like Wacken or something. Um, yeah, they're not saying. Um, yeah, not sure where this is from. Okay, but yeah, music wise, I really enjoyed uh, the song. Uh, good performance. Okay, okay, well, that was interesting. Once again, if you guys have any suggestions, don't hesitate for the time You can have a request with my stream amount and make sure I do it. As always, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and see you guys next time. See you. See you. See you.